So, of course, because the client's the one that unsubscribed, sure. we can't force that because it could be anybody requesting that to happen. And right. So what we do is we give them an email address where they can send a blank email, blank meaning no subject, no message, resubscribe me, nothing. And the email address is optin.cml at matrixemailer.com. Again, optin.cml at matrixemailer.com. Now, if you forget that, because nobody's going to remember that after sure. today, um, you can find a knowledge base article on unsubscribing, and okay. it will give the steps to do it. Okay. Really simple. They send an email. They're notified. The agent is notified that they've opted back in, and everything will continue as normal. And the great thing, too, is it doesn't really disrupt what has happened. It'll backfill once sure. they resubscribe with all the listing data that may have occurred while they were opting out. So, so Helen, as a fellow practitioner, it seems to me, and correct me if I'm wrong, I'm probably going to get a notice that they unsubscribe. You will absolutely get a notice that they've unsubscribed. Perfect opportunity for a phone call. Absolutely, because that's what I do. Did I say, you, hey, did you, did you mean, mean to <laughs> unsubscribe? Are we, not dating, are we not dating anymore? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and also a great opportunity for them to maybe switch over to text messaging auto notification oh, uh, to make it a little more timely for them. For sure. Yeah. All right, so there you go. That's this session of Did You Know?